it is 6.15, we're just about to leave home. Um, our first stop will be the Glass Den in Coburg, so that we sh should be reaching there around 9 o'clock. Um, it's actually not that cold. Yeah, yeah. surprisingly. Yeah. It not as alright. Mm -hmm. um, From what I remember last time was freezing. Yeah. This think, time. Yeah, so hopefully we, um, we're going to get there safe and sound. Uh, no injuries <laughs> for the time being. Um, Wish us luck, people. Yeah. So currently, Tim's like, I probably farted or something. Tim's staying quite a bit away from me. Oh, wait, actually. Sign says stay safe and keep that 1.5 meter distance. Good citizens, people. We good on, citizens. Hold on, hold on. Oh, you're in my space, man. Oh, ladies. Hold on, let me let me get flat. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So just passing by Dan Murphy's. Why are we going to Dan Murphy's, Andrew? I'm a bit thirsty. A bit thirsty. Do you know what time it is? Yeah, seven. Solid time for a drink. Everyone drinks at seven. Seven p.m. Not seven a.m. Oh, it is closed. We are at Edwards Lake Park. <laughs> Alright. Um, so we just reached a reservoir. It's about 7.25 now. Um, it's been a pretty good morning so far. I don't think... We're, we're feeling pretty good. Mm -hmm. um, weather's pretty nice as well. Yeah, even though it's a bit cloudy, um, it's pretty warm. So uh, that's kept us going. Um, I'll probably take my scarf off soon. Sexy uh, nest. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> a bit too early for that. Um, but yeah, so we're just going to make a quick stop here. Have a quick break. Um, and then we're going to head towards the Glass Den, which we should be reaching in about oh, an hour 20, maybe? Yeah, around about there. Yeah. I came in like a wrecking ball. Back at our friend, the Puffing Billy. I, I don't think it's the Puffing Billy. <laughs> <laughs> well, looks the same to we'll me. We'll call it man. the Puffing Barry because it's in Reservoir. But um, <laughs> it's an old favourite of mine. I used to come down to this lake every weekend when I was living in Reservoir. Came up to see this train. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll have a closer look at it. Yeah, it's actually not open, but you're not missing out on much anyway. Kind of just says historic steam train for viewing purposes only. Yeah. yeah. Um, rip, rip Thomas. Dogs must be on leash. Oh, not again. Ah, I stepped on dog shit. <laughs> <laughs> We're only about uh, just under two hours. Yeah, under two hours. We already reached Burke Street. There's no shops around, like, look at Yeah, it. people told me when I come to visit Melbourne, Burke Street's massive, it's got like malls and shops and everything. It's the worst Burke Street I've ever seen. <laughs> Alright, so we made it to the Glass Den. Keen for some brunch or breakfast. Yeah, what time is it right now? It's currently 8.45. Mm -hmm. So we we made it here in about two and a half hours. So slightly behind schedule, but that's alright because we had a couple of stops on the way. Um, so I've actually had my eye on this place for quite a while now, so I'm pretty excited to go in, get some feed. Um, so let's, we'll see how it goes. Yeah, see you inside. Alright, there's Tim's meal. You got the Eden? Eden Garden of Eden or something? Eden's, Eden's Garden, I think it was. Yeah, something like that. that. So we've got, uh, we've got falafel here. We've got some beetroot, pumpkin, uh, seeds, we've got a breadstick, we've got, um, some garnish. The lemon, the lemon from before. Yep, there's a bit of bread down here as well. So it's quite loaded. It was presented really, really well. Um, so that's easily a five out of five presentation for me, in my opinion. Um, taste wise, I think it is also uh, quite tasty. So the flavors are, they don't overwhelm each other. Um, you do get a bit of everything going on. Um, and I can't really fault it, to be honest. I, I reckon it's just a solid all round meal. So at least like 4.5 4. to 5 out of 5 in my book. Oh, solid. Perfect meal, perfect ratings, all perfect ratings. Alright, Andrew, what do you have? Alright, so I got their signature Benny. Mm. I love my Benny, the egg, the um, croquet, and the beef, I'm pretty sure it is. Yep. Good beef. Looks wise, it was spot on. 5 out of 5 for me as well. Um, in terms of taste, flavours there. Um, beef, very flavoursome. The egg, very well, well made. Runny, runny yolk, and then the croquet, crunchy. So I like it. Very, very yummy dish. All right. So I've got um, a friend of ours on the phone. So um, just gonna see if Jess wants to hang out later to grab some food. Hey, Jess. Hi. What's up? Yeah, not much. Um, you're in the area, yeah? 
yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you want to grab some, are you free to like grab some food later? Oh, sure, sounds good. All right. Wait, is Andrew there? Uh, yeah, Andrew's there. Never mind. So we're currently walking down Moreland Road and oi! What are you Fan doing? Service. Fan service! Fan service! Oi! Put the back <laughs> on! Hey guys, so we're currently walking down Moreland Road and oi! Put the back on! Going on an adventure. Use my Nook Miles ticket for this. <laughs> NMTs. <laughs> Shit is island. <laughs> it's gonna be hot. Tim, what are you doing, mate? I'm stripping down. A bit of fan service. Hey. Like yeah, we well, keep going. Why don't you take the next one off too? What do you mean? Yeah, keep going, mate. Fan what, service, what, isn't what, it? There's cars around. Doesn't matter. Let's do it. <laughs> so we're just passing a bridge over Maribyrnong River, and that is a very wide river. <laughs> Alright, so we made it to the next stop, St. Berg's. So, what time is it now? We actually got here a lot earlier than we... Um, oh, it's one, it's one ten now, um, so we got here about 20 minutes ago. Yeah, we bought already, just waiting for our food. Yeah, uh, we just spent about 20 minutes just trying to find our lost Instagram live video. Uh, so I think sad. It, I think it's gone, it's dead and gone. Thanks for those who've tuned in, yeah. but it's so sad. We lost both footage. Oh my gosh, both yeah. footages. So All for the gram. <laughs> um, but yeah, St. Berg's, we're really keen. Um, I've been, uh, Andrew and I have both been here a couple of times. So we we know that this place is um, high Solid. quality mm -hmm. um, and we are expecting nothing less today. Yep. All right, so All we've right. got our burgers. Um, I've got the cheesy D. And I just got the Durga. <laughs> ah, juicy burger, mate. So both, both a bit small, yeah, cheers. Can never fault this place. <laughs> Taste, you cannot fault. One of the best in Melbourne by far. Um, appearance, uh, get, I don't know, it's just a burger. <laughs> Can't really make burgers too beautiful, but it did come uh, fully formed and everything, so I think we made a really good choice. St. Berg's keeps up their high standards. So the Durga, their classic one. It's brilliant, guys. Like, just a simple beef burger, but it's so flavoursome. And the thing that Tim and I like about this is that the patties, they got a bit of crisp to them. So the thin patties, very well cooked. Oh, I don't know. Just a bit of crisp. Oh, there, there we go. Just that edge. Yeah. Very nice. Mm -hmm. Different texture to those thick patties and stuff like that. Definitely get on them. <laughs> oh, you're a spitter, you're a spitter. <laughs> yeah, I just see that. <laughs> Alright, so just across the road from, down the road from St. Berg's is BK. Uh, BK is renowned for its um, desserts, so we're going to grab some bingsu here. Mm -hmm. um, I'm not sure which flavour yet, we'll have to check out the menu and see. And see what's available. Yeah. So, so let's we'll go inside. Yeah, we'll show you when we're inside. Alright, got my ATAR right here. <laughs> <laughs> 100 aggregate. <laughs> All right, so we got our um, taro bingsu. Mm -hmm. Time to dig in. The jelly is quite nice. Jelly is good. Mm. Gonna get a bit of a that spoon. very very beer taste. Mm. I got gotcha. you. Mm -hmm. The bingsu itself holds together pretty well, even though I'm using a fork. Um. <laughs> He's still able to eat it with mm. the fork. Yeah, the flavor is amazing. Oh wow. Very if you nice. love taro, amazing flavour. Um, presentation, obviously it's in a container box, so I'm not complaining there, but... Yeah, and yeah. there's no, no fault of the, um, the place, like it's just because of COVID restrictions at the moment. Really enjoyed that. Guess I'll come back if I'm ever in the west side again. It's a bit far considering I'm going to be moving. More. 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 Yo, Tim, where are you going? Oh, my foot hurts. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Medical and dental clinic, oh, rest in pieces. Our next stop is Footscray though. So, 
we're not quite sure what's going to happen to us. <laughs> <laughs> if this footage never gets released, you'll know why. <laughs> so, as you guys know, we try to go live, but both times the footage was lost. <sighs> Unfortunate, because we got some good content on there. We got a lot of engagement as well. So thanks to everyone who tuned in. Mm -hmm. uh, we really thanks appreciate it. Yeah. yeah, showing us love, leaving some comments. Read a, we read them while they were live, but couldn't save them. So, yeah. yeah. You guys know who you are. You guys are real champs. Yep. Uh, but we also decided that we should probably film a section where we can actually save our answers this time yeah. in the form of just a normal video. Yeah, so last night we asked the fans, you guys, to send us some questions that you wanted us to answer during this walk. So we'll touch on to them now. All right, so... All right, first question asked by two people. Chuck, yep. give it to us. Uh, who is your celebrity crush? You want to go first? Oh, well, for those of you who know me well, you know that I like Blackpink. Um, but obviously, Rosé is my favourite. So, Rosé, if you um, watched our live stream, I think you did. I think I saw your name fall up there. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, uh, this, one, this one's for you. Yeah, and my answer was Mr. Zac Efron. I just love High School Musical too much, so Troy Bolton, you the man. <laughs> jokes, jokes. Right now, I'm rewatching Community TV show, and Alison Brie, you are amazing. All right, next one. Why, why this walk? Mm. Yeah. So I'll start us off. If you've seen previously or heard previously, we've done two walks in the past. Our first walk was a practice one to the city. So from Thomastown to the city, it took us about five hours. That was to prepare for our Monash walk. So we walked to Monash Clayton from Thomastown. Took us about 11 and a half hours, just over 40 kilometers. Very solid effort, boys. So this walk so far has taken us about eight hours. Mm -hmm. um, so we left at six, it's currently about two. Um, Quick mess. Yeah, so it's a bit, bit longer than our city walk, but obviously not as, not as long as our Monash walk. Uh, wasn't really intended to be, so we were only aiming to get to Footscray for our fob rolls. Yeah, um, boy. No, no real re other reason. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> for a bit of fun and exercise, you know. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, it, like you guys asked, like there was another question that said, you know, it's not as long as our Monash walk. Uh, that's okay. Mm -hmm. um, sometimes shorter things are better. Yeah, as long as it works, you know. <laughs> yeah, so if it does the job. Um, I remember a question as well. It was something along the lines of, which one would you rather? Extreme BO or extreme hair, body hair? Unanimous decision for body hair. Yeah, um, BO everyone. Yeah. You know, nah, none of that That's stuff. unfortunate. Yep. So the yeah. question is, are you too gay? Um, no, we're both, both taken, so. Yeah. By women. Uh, <laughs> so no, we are not. Just... Shout out to the missus, love ya. Yeah. Um, yeah, a bit, bit of bromance every now and then, it's alright. Of course. Keeps, that's what keeps you going. Exactly. Secret to longevity. <laughs> <laughs> alright Tim, where are we? What did we, we just are, get? Uh, we are at Badmin Yulang and we just got a fob roll. Yeah, so there you is, go. Uh, Boots Man, grey. Badmin Nam Nung. Mm -hmm. so, I, got for an, I got a Nam Nung as well. Yeah, this is very good. Mm -hmm. um, keen to dig in. And this is what this is what we've been waiting for. There honestly. you go, we made it guys. So I've started to dig in. Time for the review. Bang me nam nung can never go wrong. It's very solid. The bread, crispy. The meat, flavoursome. Sauce, beautiful. Parte. Um, Shop vendor, um, gorgeous. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can't go wrong with that one, eh? And um, chili's there. Not as spicy as some I've had before, so could improve there. But, mate, Bob Roll, never complaining. Beautiful. Alright, time for me to tear, tear into it. So, mm -hmm. very nice there, you can see. Or should I open it? Yeah, just give it a bit of an open. Oh, yeah, yeah so you can see the contents. Too. Got the Nam Nung, got the uh, chili, the cucumber, han, han ngo as well. Garot, mm -hmm. yuleo. You leo. Uh, what else is there? Bad there. Mm -hmm. How do cucumbers climb ladders? You leo. <laughs> 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 Alright, give it a bite, mate. <laughs> Alright, we're just gonna keep enjoying. Cheers for keeping us company on the journey. It's been a lovely adventure. Definitely heaps of fun. Craving satisfied. Mm -hmm. To congratulate Tim once again. 
Congratulations on graduating, Thank Mike. You.